What a mess! What happened here? Huh, <sighs> bitten cookies, unfinished jelly candy. Guys, it seems to me someone was here who's very picky about sweets. I think I know who can solve this puzzling case. Sam! Oh, hi there. What's up, Sue? Our viewers and I want to ask you that. What kind of sweets eating storm rushed through our kitchen? Do you know? Oh, that's what it's about? And I thought it's something serious. Sam, since when did sweets stop being something so serious to you? Now tell me what happened. Uh, Sue, it was this morning. I was looking for my dream breakfast. Yeah. And it looks like you didn't find it. Oh. It's hard to have chocolate and candy for breakfast, even for me, the most loyal fan of sweets in the world. Why didn't you just make cereal with milk? I mean, you love them. But how am I gonna make it? It's too hard for a small slime like me. Well, what's so hard about it, you pour cereal and then add milk? <laughs> well, most probably I'd spill all the cereal and all the milk, too. Duh. Sue, you'd be even more upset. <sighs> okay, okay. We need to do something about your breakfast, though. Come, I have a great idea. By the way, guys, comment on this video and tell us, what do you like to have for breakfast? Wait for me! So we'll need a whole lot of cardboard and a bit of imagination. Huh, Sue, so how can cardboard help me pour milk into cereal? We'll make a breakfast machine for you to feel like a true chef. <laughs> wow! For starters, I'll cut out eight equal trapezia. The sides of each figure are 7, 20, and 17 centimeters. Now let's put it together, shaping them like funnels. Wow, these structures are huge! Wow, one could fit a whole box of Nesquik in here. As for the cereals, we'll get to them later. And now these sticks will come in handy. Listen, Sue, maybe we should take smaller sticks. I don't mean to upset you, Sam, but skewers won't help us here. Well, then maybe we could have a skewer fight at least for truth and say. If we fight, we won't have a breakfast machine. There's still a lot of work to do. Okay, then you persuaded me. We've already made holes in each cap. Be careful when cutting. Or better ask an adult to help you with it. A hole diameter should match the sticks. Let's fasten two caps on each stick of ours, roughly this much apart. Wow, Sue, these sticks look like musical instruments. What instruments? Maracas! Oh, a doo 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 Let's get back to our cardboard. Look, I've already cut out these parts. We need to secure them on top of our structures. On one side. And on the other side. A doo 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 Oh, you need help. Nah, only if with more music. Now between our walls, we'll secure a bigger piece of cardboard. <laughs> it's more fun to glue cardboard when singing a song. We'll carefully glue our sticks over here. There shouldn't be too much glue. So what have we got here, Sue? Look, our structure works just great. Wow, cool. Now Sam's skewers will come in handy. I told you, I told you. We need to glue the skewers of two different sizes here. We'll put smaller skewers here, and we'll glue longer skewers here. It all has to be secured really well, or else the machine won't work. Let's secure our skewers together with rubber bands. One and two. Two, but the lid won't open then. Don't you worry, it's all working like it's supposed to. Compartments for cereals are ready. Now let's get to the milk dispenser. We'll need a cap like this with two holes in it. Oh, I can use this cap as glasses. <laughs> Sam! And tubes like these. Why do we need these tubes? How will they help us, Sue? You'll use these tubes as straws for your milk. Then you won't spill anything. But then it's not interesting, Sue. <laughs> I'm kidding. We should stick these tubes in the holes in our cap. Like this. Oh, Sue, I don't get it. What are we making here? We'll sort it all out in a moment. Don't panic. And now let's secure our tubes to a pump like this. So, can't we simply pour milk from a bottle? <laughs> when you simply pour milk from a bottle, we have white puddles all over the kitchen. And now we'll be able to make breakfast neatly. And milk will get straight into the glass. 
Okay, okay, you convinced me. Phew! So, are you sure we need so much cardboard? Sure, because we're about to start putting together the base for our breakfast machine. We'll need four walls that will glue together. So, we could have just taken a big box and cut out everything extra. No, Sammy, it's all calculated here, centimeter by centimeter. Oh, look at us doing it all right. Now we need to make holes in our base walls. Let's secure our compartments for breakfast cereals here. Wow, we can put breakfast into our machine already? Of course not, I haven't secured anything yet. Better help me, bring the cardboard I've prepared. Whoa! Oh, Sue, I've got it right here. Well done. So, half of the machine is ready now. Oh, only half? Well, almost. It's the most important part that's left. Speaking of which, Sam, we wanted to have a little poll with the guys. Right! Guys, comment what kind of breakfast you like most. Nesquik or Cosmo Stars. Or maybe you have a different answer. Well, shall we make our breakfast machine even prettier? Let's see, we've made a button here. Uh, what else? Let me deal with the handles. In the meantime, you print pictures. Here are the parts I've prepared. We'll secure them now. Let's glue this lever here. It will make it really easy to pour a bowl full of cereal. Now let's secure our milk dispenser. Done! Now we only need to cover our machine with this lid. Are you going to be long there, Sam? Phew! I was looking for the prettiest pictures. Hmm, I think I know what kind of cereals you're going to put in here. Well, sure! I had this poll for the viewers for a reason. Hey, Sue, hurry up and pour our cereals in! Wow, a whole Cosmo Stars pack will fit in here. Cool! Now I'll have breakfast three times a day. Well, Sam, let's test our new machine. Woohoo! It's so super convenient! And most importantly, nothing gets spilled. Here you go, Sammy. And I think I'll indulge in Cosmo Stars. Guys, do you like our breakfast machine? Mmm, it tastes so good! If you do, then give this video a thumbs up, guys! Da -da -da -da. Hey guys, today we have lots of work and we will create an amazing Mentos vending machine! Hmm, I see only a stack of cardboard bricks and not a single Mentos package. <laughs> These are the basic parts. It's better to prepare them in advance. And if you involve the whole family, it can get even more fun! Hey. What's more important? So, we get to the first magical combination. Sam, could you please bring me the skewers? Are you talking about the giant toothpicks for crocodiles? Oh, yes. As far as I know, crocodiles like to use small, lazy, pink slimes. Who do you mean? Me? If you didn't notice, I am actually helping you. Okay, you're doing a great job. And now, bring me the cutter, please. Here you go, Sue. Thank you, Sammy. Guys, don't forget to ask an adult to help you with the cutter. Come on, Sue. Very carefully, like this. Aha! We need to add glue into the holes for our giant toothpicks. And pop! Oh, wow. What an interesting thing we have here. But I don't really understand how it's going to work. <laughs> <laughs> You'll know soon. Where is our tasty material? My favorite part, candies! Where are you? Guys, we need to repeat the same action twice so we get three dispensers. Sammy! Susie! I think I guess I lost a couple of candies on the way. Oh, you poor thing. Maybe you <laughs> lost them in your belly. Wait, Sue, how did you guess? <laughs> You're a bad liar. Uh, in my defense, I can say try one and you will understand me. Well, okay. 
Mmm, it's delicious. Guys, comment below. What's your favorite Mentos flavor? That's enough. Let me take them to some safe place so you don't need all of them. Hey, hey, hey. I'll need at least one package for the craft process. Fine. Here you go, Sue. Thanks, Sammy. Ha! So, our dispensers look like this. It's getting more complicated, but we don't cut corners. Assistant, pencil, please. Coming! Sammy, are you eating candies for our craft again? How could you even think of it? Maybe I have a secret reserve. Oh, well, when the time comes to load the Mentos into the machine… Everything will be right on the spot. Okay, then I trust you, Sammy. <sighs> this cardboard kingdom is driving me crazy! Sam, no time to rest. Bring the Mentos, please. Ha! Huh, I guess today Candies took over the cardboard. <laughs> Sammy, hurry up. Done! Looks like you recharged yourself with candies again. <laughs> but I'll do this and hop! Holy cannoli! And now, Sammy, bring me the smallest pieces. I'm on it! So, what do we have here? Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. Mm -hmm. Here are all the smallest pieces! Do you really think that I meant this? I don't get it! You said bring me the smallest pieces and I brought them! Oh, Sammy, that's what I meant! I did as ordered. Mmm, tastes like bubble gum. Sammy, please spare some for the craft and for me. What do you need them for? Sam! Okay, okay, will do. And what do you have here? These parts will serve as an important section of our Mentos machine. More like a sandwich. <laughs> Actually, this reminds me more of a sandwich, but it is a special Mentos card. Mentos card? Sounds cool. You give me the Mentos card and I will be the main Mentos holder. <laughs> Did you mean Mentos eater? Hop. Nah, don't get into detail, Sue. Keep working. Yes, yes. I already placed the zip ties here. They will help us secure the rubber bands like this. So, I guess we need clippers here. Right you are. By the way, guys, what is your favorite tool to work with? Write in the comments below. And meanwhile, we need to thread these ties through the rubber bands and secure them nicely. And on the other side as well. Wow. Did I miss something? You are right on time. We are almost done with the mechanism. Where were you? Me? Uh, well, doesn't matter. Uh. We'll tighten it really well, like this. And cut off all the extra stuff, like this. And we will need three more of these. Hop, hop. And now we glue everything to the base. There we go. I wonder, where do they go? Hmm. hmm. What are you talking about? Uh, nothing. Did you call me? Yes, but I already managed it myself. And here is another task for you. Find me a bowl, but not a big one. Good. Uh, did you just say a bowl? <laughs> exactly. Okay. Whoosh. The bowl car has arrived. Hurry up and put the candies in here. <laughs> <laughs> This time, the bowl will serve as a stand for our Mentos machine. Hop! Oh, wow. Well, no luck again. Oh, so, Sammy. We're making a machine full of Mentos for you. Actually, it reminds me more of a house construction. Concrete, wax, and brick. Bang! <laughs> Sammy, I love your imagination, but we don't have any bricks or concrete here. Only glue and cardboard. Yeah, yeah. Tell me that it's not a house, but a device. It's not a house, it's a device. Susie! <laughs> okay, okay. Like this, we'll do the last part. Same thing we need to do on the other side. And I need to do an inspection. By the way, guys, don't forget to subscribe to our channel, especially if you like funny slimes. And for the next stage, we'll need a window like this. They're not there! So I found my secret place! Oh, Sammy, I'm 
pretty sure you simply forgot where you put it. No, no, I never forget things. I, I was testing the flavors. First one, then another. Oh, right. I guess he finally remembered. <laughs> and we need to repeat the same actions with the two dispensers that are left. There we go. Grab it, Susie. Don't worry. I found the candies. I wasn't actually worried. Really? Whatever. I'm so looking forward to the candy finale. This stage is done. Ugh, and I'm ready to build a machine with candy. We did attach the lids, but that's not all. Didn't you forget something? I guess no, but let's check. Okay, Mentos. Mentos, strawberry, Mentos, mixed peach. Nope, everything's here. Gee, Sammy, you only think about candies. What about the decorations? <gasps> How can I forget? And all this will become the base, which will help our machine turn around. Here is my masterpiece. Where do we stick it? Good job, Sam. We'll put them aside for a moment. I still need your help here. Oh, wow. The sandwich again? What for now? You will see. So now I need a screwdriver. Actually, I didn't expect to see the screwdriver here. Like this. Guys, ask an adult to help you. We make the hole so the cap can fit in there. Get ready for a great adventure, Mr. Cap. Hop. Wow, Susie looks interesting. Oh, yeah. So another touch and we can... We can attach the part with the cap. Yeah, you're totally right, Tammy. One, two, three, <laughs> done. It's like a real merry-go-round. And now we only need to decorate our machine. And voila! Looks amazing! Wow, the machine is ready, isn't it? Yep, we only need the candies. Awesome! I guess it's my paradise. <laughs> Get up, friend. <sighs> it's time to put our candies into the Mentos Wonder Machine. Susie? never been so much fun to part with candies. Let's fill our Mentos machine and pop, pop, pop. Strawberry, apple, mixed beach. Ugh, so tasty. This craft is just the best. Hmm. Here's our Mentos machine. Stop, stop. How are we gonna get the candies from there? I thought you'd never ask. Give it to me. Let me show you how it works first. It's time for a Mentos party! Yay! <laughs> and the next one. Whoa, it's working perfectly. Ta-da! Here comes the apple Mentos. Bam! 